Morning guys, it is 8.20 and I'm on my way to the gym and I am tired. Uh, I guess I am jet lagged. I was in California for the latter part of last week for work. I just got back yesterday. I kind of slept all day and I was still able to sleep last night and I'm tired this morning. But I'm up and I'm so glad to be back into my regular routine. Not gonna lie you guys, I was not on plan at all in California. You know, my thought process is when you go somewhere you've never been before, you know, don't take it too seriously. But to be honest, the entire first half of April has just been one big cheat day and I'm over it. Like I am ready to get back to eating like I have some sense. I'm ready to get back to eating so that I feel good. I've been feeling like crap. Isn't it crazy that even when I eat the food that makes me feel like crap, I'm still eating it. Like why? I don't know. <sighs> so I'm just ready to get back to working out, feeling good. Got a good meal prep today. Still sticking with the pizza omelets. Those things are amazing. I'll show you how I make those. Then I think I'm just gonna go with cheeseburger in a bowl. I'm starting Keto Connect's cut next week. So I am looking forward to the strict low carb, low total carb situation that that's gonna bring. So this week I will be finishing up some of my carb desserts such as the Lily's chocolate that I have. Uh, the Atkins bars that I have, I will be including those in my diet for this final week until the 90 days are over. So get it together and let's go to the gym. messed up. Chocolate's on sale.
real talk, you guys, this little Jimmy Dean's Simple Scrambles Bacon, Egg, and Cheese is amazing. Like, I think it was 250 from the store. It has 21 grams of fat, two carbs, and 24 grams of protein. And it's just a little cup, and it comes with eggs already in their own little Keurig size cup. And the topping, in this case bacon and cheese, is in a little pouch. So you pour the eggs into this cup, heat it up for a little bit, then you dump in the toppings, mix those around and heat it up, and then you get just the greatest little scramble for two net carbs. I am here for it. This is an amazing snack. I will be purchasing more of these. It is almost 4 30 and i'm finished with meal prep so let's see what we got all right first up is pizza omelets so i make omelets now just sometimes they're good sometimes they're not but at least i make them so i have six omelets i cover that in rails tomato sauce mozzarella parmesan and then this italian seasoning that i bought from the store it's really good and then for dinner, I'm gonna have cheeseburger salad. So I have baby spinach and the ground beef that I made. I have some onions and cilantro and jalapeno and also some cheddar cheese that I'm going to put on top of that. And then for desserts, I have my Atkins bar and oh, my Lily's chocolate right here. And then also throughout the day, I'm gonna have a coffee. So here's the cold brew, here's the almond milk, and then I also have some of that sugar-free syrup. All right, so that's it for me. I am done with meal prep for the day. You saw I had some Sunday bacon and that Jimmy Dean bacon and egg cup. I mean, that was delicious. Uh, I've had an Atkins bar already, and I'm not sure what I'll have for dinner. I don't know, there's still plenty of bacon left, so probably some of that and some other stuff. And then I'm ready for the week, ready to get back on plan. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Watch Autumn Keto. Also ding the notification bell to get notified whenever I put up a new video. You can also find me on Instagram at Watch Autumn Keto. Thanks and I'll catch you next week.